morning. Uh, this is Antonio Lorenzo and welcome back again to my channel. Uh, today, I will prepare an apple pie. Uh, the recipe for this apple pie is very easy and yet very delicious apple pie. So to start with, we need a 3 cups of all-purpose flour. In this bowl, I have already 1 cup of purpose flour, so I need another 2. Okay. So, three. Then, very easy. Just put one uh, teaspoon of salt. Then, one tablespoon of sugar. So, so this will be our crust for our apple pie. So, just mix. That's it. Then we need then we need 200 grams of butter. But for the butter, we need to cut the butter into cubes. So so we are going to cut the butter into cubes. Then we are going to put into the to the flour. You see? So we need to coat the butter by the flour to make our pie crust uh, flaky. Then we will use the pork or smasher or whatever to reduce the size of the the size of the butter into pea size. So this is very easy. So when the size of the butter become like this one, same as the this, same as the pea size. Okay, that's it. this is it. Then we will add a few tablespoons of uh, cold water. So we need lemon. We will put into uh, cold water. So, what is the purpose of lemon in the in this recipe? Actually, the acidity in the lemon will prevent the gluten. There is no exact amount of water to put it here. Because uh, you know, the starts are the flour, they behave differently. Just observe the behave the behavior of your uh, dough. If they start to form together by pressing it, so that will be the enough uh, consistency. So we will form this into a dough. Okay, so we will form this into dough. This is our dough now. We are going to divide this into two because one is for the bottom uh, and the other for the, uh, for the cover. Uh, then I will put it into fridge for at least uh, 30 sec uh, 30 minutes. So this is it. This is our dough for our pie crust. So I will put this one into fridge for about not me, for about 30 minutes of our uh, apple filling. So for this recipe, we need 7 apples like this one, this size. So we are going to cut this into small sizes so that it will be fully uh, uniformly cooked. So 
So we need to peel off the apple. Remove the center core, this one. Then we need to cut small sizes like this one. So, so we're going to chop all these seven apples into these small sizes. So this will be our uh, apple chunks with this size. Then we are going to put a uh, 3 fourth cup of brown sugar. A half cup of white sugar. We we'll fully mix this one. And also we need to add cinnamon, about one tablespoon of cinnamon. And to make the uh, filling a little bit sticky, let's put cornstarch, about one third cup of cornstarch. Then set aside. Then we will put this one into our uh, pie crust. We are going now to prepare the pie crust. Remember this is the dough that we chilled in the fridge for 30 minutes. So we will prepare now the pie crust. So let's sprinkle the flour into the working table. Don't worry. This dough is very forgiving. It will not absorb too much of this uh, flour. So this will be our uh, so it needs so we need to work again to enlarge this one. We need to roll into the pin so that we can transfer it to the Actually, we put I put butter already for this one, so that it will not stick. Okay, perfect. So this is the the now. See. This is our pie crust now for our apple pie. And I will go in to make now the, what do you call this one? The cover or the top crust. Till it's frozen. So this will be our cover for the apple pie hey. the center so we need to roll up the center okay then we are now going to transfer now the the filling so this is our now the pie crust I'm going to put white oats at the bottom of this is it. So the bottom white crust, we put the uh, quarter oats. Then we are going to transfer now the filling.
Then we are going now to put the cover. So this will be our center now. Center. So this one. Okay, now for the final touch, we're going to brush uh, melted butter on top of this one. Then uh, sprinkle some sugar, white sugar, granulated sugar. And then, of course, cinnamon powder. Uh, we are going to bake this one at preheated oven at 350 degrees Fahrenheit for about 18 to 20 minutes. Let's see. Oh, very hot. Okay. Okay, it's time to check this one. Actually, I baked this one for about 50 minutes. Sorry, I said earlier about 18 to 20 minutes, but it's 50 minutes. Let's check. Wow, very hot. Oh, delicious. Wow. Perfect. Very nice. So this is it. This is our freshly baked apple pie. So... We need to cool this one at uh, about two hours before we slice. Uh, before we slice it, mm. I can't take it anymore. I want to eat now. <laughs> okay, let's see. This is it. The most important part of our video: the taste test. So, I will slice now this one. Then let's see. Delicious. See this one? Smells so delicious. Taste. So I will taste it for you. Mmm. Very delicious. The crust is so good, so flaky. So it is very timely, you guys, to try also this one. It you don't need to go to the pastries to get a very delicious apple pie or cake. So, so try to bake in your house. Really very delicious. Bon appetit.